Hello and welcome to Frostpunk. So we already played through this game. I made a series on this game. And in that series we played through the main story, A New Home. And there are also other stories that I want to play through. And the first one of those other stories is The Arcs. So we're going to play this scenario. Uh, what is this about? As the brightest minds of Oxford and Cambridge, we have been sent to save priceless seeds and plant specimens from eternal winter. Do we have what it takes to keep the seedling arcs safe? And we also have a little bit more information on the mission. So we have been chosen to safeguard a priceless treasure the seeds and seedlings of plants from all over the world. They have been deposited in seedling arcs to stop them from freezing, but it falls to us to build a city to protect these precious buildings until the winter ends, however long that may be. The only way to do this is with automatons. We will ensure the green earth is reborn even if we aren't there to witness it. Let's get to work. I'm not going to read everything out loud. I will leave it on screen long enough for you to read it yourself. And I will also summarize what it says. Basically, this is saying that we have to find some factory plants. So let's start by pausing the game. This is saying that the temperature of this seedling arcs can't fall below chilly. So now it's livable. So it is now at a good temperature, but it can't drop too much, the temperature of these arcs. Let's first start by looking at the map and understanding the mission. So what do we have? We got these seedling arcs, and there are four of them. And these seedling arcs are filled with seeds and seedlings. So right now the world is freezing over, but sometime in the future, this freezing might stop and the world will return to its regular temperature. And when the world returns to its regular temperature, we are going to need seeds to cultivate the earth, to grow plants again. And we can get those seeds from these seedling arts because they are stored in here. A problem is that the weather might also become worse might become colder and when the weather becomes worse these seedling arcs are in danger of getting destroyed the seedlings and seeds inside of these uh, arcs might get destroyed so what we have to do is we have to keep these seedling arcs safe and we can keep them safe by heating them so we got this generator that generates heat we can also build other buildings to heat the seedling arcs and we have to also do that for a very long time. We don't know how long it's going to take for the world to return to its uh, regular temperature. It might be never. So we now have 45 uh, people, 45 engineers that can work. But these people are eventually going to die. So we're going to have to automate everything. Uh, we have to automate uh, the mining of coal. So we can always keep these uh, seedlings safe, keep them warm. And we're going to have to uh, automate mining of resources so we can repair things. Uh, we have to make sure that this place can run for an unlimited time. And the way we automate things is with these automatons. So these things can work in certain places and they will keep working for an unlimited time. So they might need to get repaired but we can also automate the repairing right uh, so yeah that's basically the goal of this mission protect these seedlings arcs and do that by automating everything we have one automaton we got 45 engineers and we're gonna have to build this uh, area up with the manpower that we have right now 
So that's what we are going to do. And we also have to explore because we have to build more automatons and to build more automatons, we need uh, to build a factory and the factory plants are somewhere in the world. So we're going to also have to explore. So we're going to have to do that fast. So we're going to get started. And how are we going to get started? Well, we need some wood and an easy way to get some wood in this game in the beginning or in this scenario in the beginning is by dismantling some of these roads. So there are these roads around the arcs that are not really necessary right now. So we can get rid of those roads. Also, for example, get rid of this road and we can connect it with a shorter road. But these roads are not necessary and they give us a little bit of extra wood to work with. So we can dismantle these and that will help us a lot in the beginning. Okay. So there we go. So this, th this thing is connected again. And then if you take a look here, we see that we have some wooden crate piles. We can gather from those. We got a little few wooden crate piles over here as well. We got a coal pile over there. So what we can do is we can build like these gathering posts. And these gathering posts will gather from these piles. So that's what we're going to do as well. And then also important. So one important thing that we have to do is we have to research a lot and we have to research fast. So I'm already going to build a research building and we're going to start researching immediately. And we're going to have to research ways to gather resources more efficiently, better. We're going to have to uh, research uh, heating technologies and we're going to have to research a lot. So let's get the automaton over here. So it will uh, start gathering from these uh, piles. And now that we built that research building, we can also start research. And I'm going to start with the beacon. So we can start exploring immediately. And then if you take a look here, we can also do some laws. So uh, we're going to do the sustain life law. And you can read it yourself. I'm not going to read it out loud. There we go. So now it starts gathering from these piles. And I'm not going to turn on the generator. I'm only going to turn on the generator once it's night. So we're not, we don't have to turn on the generator the whole day. Again, we have to be efficient until we get some uh, better resource gathering buildings. But for now, uh, this is really inefficient. Let's go. Uh, gathering coal and you need coal to work the generator so this is really inefficient right now so we're gonna have to be uh, careful with burning through that coal and these guys want houses i'm not going to build houses we need some other things first so exactly the first few days are the most difficult and we got that so what we can do also is we can build a gathering post over here so we can gather even more and i'm going to connect it over there so now we got two gathering posts and this is telling me that the heating is off but we have to gather some coal before we can do that so we almost researched our first research the beacon i think it will be done tomorrow i want to thank you guys for watching please leave a like also leave a comment comes really up with the algorithm and you will be able to me out and subscribe thanks again for watching and bye bye